short. Lee Kane Corns with his first touch. Drives it long and finds his target. That's a really good mark and a great kick there from Kane Corns. We saw the perfect kick from Kane Corns there to West Off and he's got a kick from 40. He was going to centre it then. Change mid-run, comes in and he pops it through for a goal. That is quite bizarre. One of the smallest men on the ground. Here's young Brendan Archie for Port. Good hand pass. Finds Ebert. Now Robbie Gray. Watch him use this ball. He does. It's Hamish Hartlett who's got it inside 50. He's looking to centre up. That's a wonderful kick, like a tracer bullet. Sammy Gray started terrifically well last year and seen him snag another one now. He loses possession quickly, so good pressure there from the Eagles. But just as quickly as they win it, Matty Rose has turned it over. Their pressure and tackling and tenacity is just first rate at the moment. Port, have a look at the handball, the way they move the ball. It's electric. Kane Corns takes the mark, goes to Robbie Gray. He'll have a shot at goal. That's the goal of the match so far. You know, we've seen him follow up there, get back hard and defend, and that's what you love with a forward as we see him get it again, Tommy. He's done brilliantly, forced the spoil, then got it back, goes the handball to Prittis, top of the square, mark taken, Tom Lamb, take a bow, young man. Ten metres out, directly in front, the former blue comes in, pops it through, and that's better from West Coast. It does really nicely. Kane Corns, he's tackled, that should be holding the ball. It is. Under the new interpretation, if you don't give the first option, you will be penalised. The umpires have met with all of the clubs and with the media, and that is definitely the way they're moving. Lamb, just a terrific last six or seven minutes. He comes in. He needs some reward for effort because he's been so good. He gets it. <laughs> Only a pre-season game, but try telling them that. That was well done. Now, here's Tunbridge on the left boot. Goes inside 50. Neat Sorry. kick. Gee, that was lace out. That was a beautiful delivery inside 50. It was just a nothing effort. Didn't take body, didn't take ball, took nothing at all. He's such a good exponent of the kick, Mark Lacroix, and that is dead straight. And it's serving them very well in this second quarter. Sam Gray's got the ball now. He's been busy in this quarter. He gets the handball back from Brad Ebert. Gray, that Sam elects to go backwards again to Westhoff, who's tucked up against the boundary line. John Butcher running back with a fly to the ball. He's going to say, Tommy, if he can mark him in these spots, it certainly won't be a problem as he puts that through the middle. Wines goes after it. Been pretty quiet in this game. Goes to Stewart. Now a little left foot kick goes long and forward there from Amon. And a mark taken by Xavier Ellis. As he pinged his hammy, this doesn't look good. As he comes to the bench, let's hope it's not too serious. He's got the ball now. He goes long up inside 50. Schultz can't take it. Ollie winds off the ground. The ball somehow finds its way to Aaron Young. Dribbles it on the ground. What a magnificent goal. The best of the day. And Aaron Young, again, one of those fringe players who has to attract the attention of the coaches. He's done it in a big way there. That's a magnificent finish. And it's Port Adelaide winning the opening clearance. And that was really well worked. And the mark taken by Westhoff. It was Ollie Wines who won it, so he's obviously OK. Kane Corns goes short, too short, in fact. Umpire said didn't travel 15. He got the handball back, works it to Amon on the left. Open goal. That's a great start to the third quarter and a fabulous finish from the young man. He elects to go short and Carpenter again. He's done well. After getting caught a moment ago, he goes to handball. No, he doesn't. Umpire elect says you've got to play on now. You've taken too long. He gets himself out of trouble, though. So can he get the carry? Andrew Gaff. I reckon he's got the distance. It's just a question of accuracy. No problem there either. The tackle was still on, and he drew the free kick. He plays on quickly. Here is Nathan Cracker, the man you were saying should come on, and it's a great first touch. West Coast, 5-5, 35. 17 points the margin. Strong mark. He can't take the mark. Ball spills to ground. O'Shea's got it. Just grubbers a kick. Up inside 50. Taking it there, Benel. He's quickly tackled, and the umpire's going to pay holding the ball. Terrific wrap-up by Mitchell, and he earned himself a kick on goal. So he comes in now, kicks on its way. I reckon it's got the carry. I think it's got the accuracy as well. It does. Goes the long kick. Look at that contest there from Cleary and Lamb. Great stuff. Lamb went a second time as well. Gee, I love the look at him. Have a look at the handball. One-two there from Carlisle to Amon, now to Boak. They move the ball so fast for Adelaide. Butcher can't take the mark, but Robbie Gray doing what a good coming forward should. Sharks it, kicks it, goal. He comes in board to Kane Lucas, taken at pick 12 ahead of Daniel Talia in that draft by the Blues. And a grab in front of the eyes. He's got a shot from 45 metres out. You can see why Port Adelaide went so hard for him in the off-season. 
He comes in, kicks on its way. That's good. The goal umpire likes it. So do his teammates. Last season with such dominant display, but just playing, twi twittering too much with it across half back. Too much handball. Well, again, they've gone by the handball. It's going to work out all right in the end. Andrew Moore should be a nine pointer. That's a wonderful finish. It was messy. It wasn't clean, but it gets the desired result. Uh, certainly competition for spots. Well, he's got another chance here, Amon. Have a look at that kick. That was a worm burner. Wakes, I wish I got on Robbie Gray for the brand. I reckon he's 26 bucks at the moment. Gamble responsibly, thanks to Tats, but he comes in. He kicks his third. <laughs> Watch the NAB Challenge live on your mobile or tablet. Get your four-week free trial at afl.com.au forward slash live pass or in the AFL live app.